Games. Why do I say so? We are honored to have the world junior champion in this race. That's Shawnee Miller from the Bahamas, born on the 15th of April, 1994. She is joined in this race by the third fastest junior in the world this year, Olivia James of Jamaica, who has run 52.90 so far this year. She is also, they are joined, that's the World Junior Champion on your screen, Shawnee Miller, won the World Junior Championships in 2010 last year. And the next lady you'll see on the screen is Chris Ann Gordon, the fastest junior in the world this year with a personal record 51.62 it's amazing with this lineup these top three young ladies that we can actually miss Ristanana Tracy of Jamaica who is the second fastest junior in the world this year she did not run at the Jamaican Caristic trials and therefore is not here this evening the race however between these three young ladies Chris Ann Gordon, the fastest junior in the world this year. Olivia James, the third fastest junior in the world this year. And Shawnee Miller of the Bahamas, the world junior champion. Hubert, this one will be hot. Grace Jackson, they're walking back to the blocks. Your thoughts on the girls in the 2400? I mean, I think I, I agree with uh, Judge Bruce for sure. I think this is going to be one of the most exciting races. If they keep their nerves and just run their races, I think what we'll have is fast times coming across for one, two, and three. Miller ran a Bahamian junior record, 52.45, in the semis at the World Juniors last year in Moncton. She's in lane number four. Miller in the blue and the gold. And another callback for this 400. Lots of tension down there. And uh, what could have caused... Uh, that callback and will there be a false start will someone be disqualified for false starts well our focus we are going to confess to our viewers were on lanes three four and five we did not see anything unusual there but uh, the young lady in lane eight looks a little uncertain so that's chelsea campbell of tnt and uh, the starting team having a discussion together yes. and uh, Chelsea Campbell goes back to lane number eight and uh, starts his assistant, steps onto the track, gets some more advice. And my uh, start coordinator, Alfred Francis. They walk off the track and uh, more conferences across there. And, and the red card shown to Chelsea Campbell of TNT. So she's uh, eliminated. Tough for her to come all the way from TNT, but those are the rules and uh, interpreted by the crew mm -hmm. as a false start disqualification for Campbell of TNT. She seemed to have recognized her because she wasn't walking back to her lane initially, which made us think, you know, she a might have house recognized her. On the grandstand side, uh, watching the girls in the 2400. The record. Ladies and gentlemen, 51.30 seconds set by Sunita Sutherland of Jamaica. Oh! And, uh, another false start. And uh, there's Anguish. Is that lane number four where the world junior champion starts? And yes, it is. Shane Miller, the world junior champion. Shock of shocks is disqualified on false starts in the Carifta Games under 2400 meters. She walks back to her blocks with her hands on her head. She knows what we know. She is eliminated on false starts. Her first false start and uh, eliminated is the World Junior Champion. Those tears are about to fall and uh, we cry with her. She's a World Junior Champion. She can't win the 400 final. This is a big, big surprise shock, and I will admit a blow yeah. to this race. Regardless of the result now, ladies and gentlemen, you have just lost the opportunity to see the world junior champion the from the Bahamas. last year from Karit Street Thompson, react, don't anticipate. Girls on the 2400. Shanae Miller disqualified. She was in lane four from the Bahamas. Remaining in the race is Chris Ann Gordon of uh, Jamaica. She has the fastest time among juniors at 
6-2. She's running comfortably through this first 100 meters. Just to her outside, Charles of Antigua and Marbud in the dark strip. On the outside, Enora of Belfort on the outside. It's Chris Ann Gordon running fast in the back straightaway. Her Jamaican teammate cruising. That's Olivia James. The Jamaicans first and second in the 400 meters. Gordon and James lead through this third 100 meters. James hits the hammer in the third 100 meters, attacking her teammate. Gordon on the outside, James on the inside. It's Chris Ann Gordon of Jamaica. 51-62 at the Jamaican High School Championships. James, the world, the Youth Olympic finalist, gets right to her. Olivia James upsets the 400 meter field with a win. 52-60 for Youth Olympic finalist Olivia James. 52-64 and Chris Ann Gordon shot. She's in second, 52-74. Shock upon shock in the 400 meters. Miller eliminated on false starts. And the favorite, Chris Ann Gordon, upset by her teammate, Olivia James. You know, there's a reason we run the races, ladies and gentlemen. And I will confess that I'm very, very disappointed that young Miller from the Bahamas did not get to run. But that is why we have to run the races. And then I'm amazed that Chris Ann Gordon, who ran 51-62, one second faster than the winning time there by young Olivia James, would lose here. But all credit to Olivia James. Yes, Amazing. Sure. Running a personal record, I would Absolutely. say, Hubert. 52-64 to win at the Caribbean Games. If people were to gamble on this sport, many, many would have lost because no one would have given the third fastest junior in the world this year, Olivia James, a chance to beat both Miller, who defeated herself, and Chris Ann Gordon, who was lost in the street. And I would be one of the few that would have given her that opportunity. I saw her at Youth Olympic Games last year. I, I saw her attitude. I saw what she has been doing this year. And when I saw the position that she had in the race, I said she had a good chance of any of the other two. And I too, like you, Bruce, have been very, very disappointed with Bahamas coming out of the race. Presentations in the boys on the 17, 500 meters. Nick Lando, second last year, moves up to take the gold medal this year. And to his left, Jorel Belafonte of the Cayman Islands. He takes the silver medal. Edgar of uh, St. Lucia who broke away early, a brave ploy that got him the bronze medal. And uh, excitement inside the Montego Bay Sports Complex. Grace Jackson can't control her emotion. She was the manager for that team, <laughs> track and field team at the Youth Olympic Games. And uh, Jamaica won two there with uh, Bella Fonte goes to high school in Jamaica, so the Jamaican fans give him a special hello. And uh, Nicholas Landu taking the gold medal. Boys, under 17, 15. And Bruce James, you're still shocked. I, I'm still in shock at the 400 meters, but I'm so thrilled for this young gentleman on the stand from Trinidad and Tobago, Nicholas Lando. He said, I have won the gold, but I'm disappointed I didn't break the record. Here we see the final 110 meters of the 400 meters. Grace yes, Jackson. And Olivia James in lane three, a fantastic lane for 400 meters. Saw where she was able to run the last straight away, running away from the field. Remember now, earlier she had run 53.5. She had run actually a better time than the other Jamaicans. So she was positioned to be able to do what she has just done uh, on the track. We're going to go down to track side to Jermaine Brown and uh, Pratt, the winner of the triple jump. Uh, Shamar, you won the, the under-17 boys, the triple jump here, 13.63 for you. You said you're a bit disappointed with that. Go ahead, go ahead and tell us just why. I'm disappointed because when I came into the Corifta of the Games, I was jumping 14, 14 plus. I was looking to go more, but the conditions were, they didn't like, it wasn't like home, so um, I would take the 13. You also have the long jump coming up on the 17s. How ready and prepared are you? Uh, I'm really prepared. I'm looking to go over six, nine, seven meters, probably uh, PB. 
and looking to win another gold medal. Well, thank you so very, uh, so very much, Shamar, and all the best in the long jump. Thank you. Shamar Rock. Thank you very much, Jerry.